Hi, I'm Selva Lani. I'm going to explain to you on how to make a foam fountain. Okay, now I'm going to explain to you the apparatus and materials that we are going to use. 6% H20 volume of hydrogen peroxide. Warm water. 100 cm cubic measuring cylinder. Potassium iodide and yeast as a catalyst. Liquid dishwash, a safety goggle. First, add 150 ml of hydrogen peroxide. Add a tablespoon of yeast and potassium iodide as catalyst. Next, pour two tablespoons of water into the beaker. Potassium iron and yeast well. Make sure yeast is dissolved. Then add it into the solution.
feed some liquid in the wash. a glass basin, beaker, a tablespoon, potassium magnet, and a safety cooker. Make sure you wear your safety cooker. First, Place the beaker into the glass basin and add half tablespoon of potassium magnet into the beaker. hydrogen peroxide into the measuring cylinder and 
and squeeze dishwashing liquid into it. Mix it well. And pour it into the beaker. to decompose hydrogen peroxide into oxygen and water. The oxygen produced is pushed out of the beaker by the foam produced by dishwashing liquid. The experiment is warm which indicates that it's an exothermic reaction. That's all for today. Thank you. Bye-bye. Okay, now let us try another experiment using hydrogen peroxide and potassium permanganate. Make sure you wear your safety goggles. Pour 50 ml of hydrogen peroxide into the measuring cylinder. Next, transfer the potassium and meat into the glass jar and stay away from the glass jar. Okay, let us listen to the explanation of this experiment. Potassium for manganate is reduced to manganese for oxide by hydrogen peroxide. This reaction emits a lot of oxygen and heat and this causes the water to boil. That's all. Thank you.